Sean Sewell with ingamit.com, and these are the Tread Lab Albion sandals. These guys right here from the founder of Chaco. These are really, really comfortable sandals and they have a lot of features um, that I've really come to appreciate uh, using the last uh, two and a half, three months. So the end of winter into spring here in Colorado. And uh, before they get too dirty, <laughs> I wanted to do this review to show you the features and functions of these guys because they're really cool. So let's get into it. First and foremost, sizing. I'm 11 and a half normal width foot and these run a little small. So I went with a size 12. This is a size 12 right here. What really makes these sandals really amazing I'll give you a little background story real quick. I have arthritis in both my feet. It's called hallux rigidus, which means rigid big toe. So basically my big toe does not flex much at all. And then on top of that, I broke my foot two months ago. So I was in a walking boot, walking cast, up until about two and a half weeks ago. However, before I broke my foot, and now currently I was wearing these sandals, and it's great because if you have limited range of motion in your toes, you know that putting your foot into a shoe can be really painful and challenging. So a sandal uh, makes that a whole lot easier. You can slide your foot in and then this metal, uh, mesh has a bit of elastic to it so you can slide around your heel and therefore um, being much more comfortable to put on. So my medical stuff aside, maybe you understand how arthritis works and maybe you have it and maybe you're looking for a slip on sandal um, in which case i'd highly recommend these but besides that these are also really fantastic for everyday people without messed up feet um, as they have great arch support as you can see right here the arch support contours to your feet it's really quite amazing arch support and if you've ever owned chacos you can uh, attest to that and so you, you get basically like a supportive sandal that is actually quite useful for being active. I, before breaking my foot, I took these out um, quite a bit. I trained them at the gym. Um, I did some light hiking with them, um, took my dog on tons of walks, and then of course casually used them to go to a store and stuff like that. And now again, after the recovery from the breaking the feet and dealing with, with the arthritis, they've been extremely clutch. because so I can easily slide my foot in, boom, and then it securely is in place there. You get these nice aluminum buckles. And then from the eco point, um, there's no glue in these. And this is a micro suede right here, so it's kind of really got nice grip. Does a really good job with sweaty feet too. So as we're getting into warmer months here, um, I like things cool. As you know from this channel, I camp in the winter. I love split boarding. I love snow. I love cold. So my feet sweat a bit. So this material did a really good job compared to some other sandals. I won't mention names or anything. I'm not trying to throw anybody under the bus. Just want to mention that some sandals get a little bit slippery. These, however, did not, which is a really nice feature. And the, the mechanism in which it holds your foot in place is really, really awesome. I've tested a lot of sandals and I have a lot of sandals I enjoy. They have a lot of straps and you have to finick with stuff. This one, I don't know how they designed it. Well, they have experience from Chaco, of course, but they, they designed it so efficiently that you just, your foot is cradled and secured as good, if not better than any sandal I've tried. And that's saying quite a bit, even ones with multiple straps to adjust. So you got that going for you. Plus they, they look good. Like even though they're an open-toed shoe. Uh, they look good. Uh, I would, I'm going to wear them on date night tonight, actually. They have incredible arch support. Not too soft, but not too firm. You can see how my foot is shaped. That's how it contoured to it. And then the aluminum buckle is easy to adjust. It's just one thing to adjust. There's no straps back here over here. It's just this one buckle. Makes it very streamlined. Get a topo you know, design, which is kind of cool. And then the tread is something often overlooked with sandals. Look at this tread. It is legit. It has some grippy, grippy tread. Yeah, there you go. So totally functional outside use, comfortable, lightweight, and washable. Again, if you are playing in creeks, rivers, ocean, or we got sweaty, stinky feet, it's nice to be able to wash your shoes or wash your, wash your sandals. Pretty sweet stuff. They're 120 US. I'll put a link below if you do want to pick up a pair. Men's and women's available, different colors. You can get a version with the, the coverage right here or without it. So it'd be more like, more like that. 
So your choice, they got you covered. Hopefully you found this helpful. Um, been really impressed with these and I wanted to show this video before I got them dirty, like I said, dirtier, <laughs> I should say. So got any questions, put those in the comments below. Get right back to you. We actually have more stuff from Tread Labs coming up here too. So if you want to see that, consider subscribing to our um, Engearment YouTube channel. Uh, if you got anything you want to share about Tread Labs that you've experienced, share away. Teach us what you're what you're doing, what you're experiencing. Love to learn from you guys. As always, I'm Sean Sewell, owner and director Stoke for Engearment. Until next time, take care. <laughs>